I'm for each country deciding how it can keep its citizens safer. And Iceland is a good example of a country where you have a very, very law-abiding citizenry, educated population, a country where people believe in, in hunting and the right to bear arms for purposes of hunting, and where your crime rate with regard to guns is very, very low. So my belief is uh, Iceland is a model country in terms of to prove that you can be armed as a citizenry, have an armed citizenry, and still have a safe country. Yeah. So we can, uh, we can live by example or other countries can look at Iceland as an example in that matter. You can look at Iceland as an example that you can have a highly armed citizenry in relation to the population and still have a safe country. What I don't want people to do is to think that you can use the Iceland model and transplant it to another country. Um, there are countries where they believe you should have low access to guns, and there are countries where you believe you should have high access to guns. And I believe that each country should decide for itself which it should be.